Hello beauty news family, welcome back to the makeup breakup. This is a series where we destroy balls. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's true. Alright guys, so we are back with a Guerlain Meteorites product. It's been now, years, my friend. It's been years. If you go back to the early, early days of the makeup breakup when we were footloose and fancy free and really fucking inspired by destroying makeup, my my how times have changed, uh, we <laughs> featured a Guerlain product and it was the Meteorite Balls. We actually stuck it in a um, like a spice grinder. Great times, fucking great times. I still remember filming that video. It was yeah. good fun. Now, Guerlain have not released anything that was interesting enough for us to want to feature on the makeup breakup since until now. Dun dun dun. We have the Meteorite Glow Pearls Cushion. Now, this would usually not pique our interest. However, I was browsing online and I saw a very close up photo of this that was beautifully taken and it appeared that underneath the cushion were individual liquid balls in multiple different shades. And that's when I was like, I'm getting this, I'm cutting it open and I'm seeing what the hell is going on in here. You guys ready for some destruction? Packaging destruction. Woo! Oh. Oh, they're She's refillable. All right. Well, there we go. That's handy because this was in the way. This was in the way. Now, oh, I wonder. No. Look. Let's not push our luck. We already we already had a good time. Um, we want to push the balls. We want to see what happens when we put pressure on the balls. Push them. Now, can you just rub your finger over it and sure. see what it looks like? Well, I can Ooh. tell you it's wet and not much happens. Oh, yeah. Now, it's meant to be a primer, and I don't know if you'll be able to see, but there is like wetness on the cap. Here. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it just feels wet. I don't know what that is. I think we have to pop the balls to get the priming goodness. Oh, it's, oh it's like a trampoline, yeah, but just, the balls... Just, they go underneath. They hide. They do hide. They move. Look at it moving. It's so <laughs> squidgy. Oh, girl on. This is fun. Should we try with this, maybe? All right, the applicator. Look, let's try with the applicator. We got it. What's so there's, the applicator like? Is um, it... it feels like a sort of a rubberized foam. Okay. I'm just going to do it on one part so we're not destroying all the balls. Oh, look at the balls move. Ah, <gasps> oh, that's so cool! <laughs> it's like Guerlain camo paint. Let's have a look. Oh, it does nothing. Very good. Very effective. March cover. <laughs> well, it's a primer. It's it is a cover. primer. It feels silicony. All right, do we want to cut this? Joyous! Look at it just peeling back from the little balls, the little paintballs. They do look like mini paintballs. This is my type of paintball. You know when you go to like the, the shops and there's some guy there who's I'm like, so Hey you, wanna have some fun? I'm like, no. no. <laughs> Onto it. Oh, they like that. What's that ice cream? Oh, yeah, Dippin' Dots. Dippin' Dots. Look at it. Wow. That's kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah. So they're literal little like bubbles. Full yeah. Of they're colored like, primer. I'm just going to take sort of a scoop of them and pop them on the table for later. Oh, they're. Oh, they're moving back. They're covered in something They've and got they're a really. Life of their own. They're really slippery. 
is arguably the best ball video we've done. I think this is the best ball video we've done. They're surprisingly firm. Are they? And they're a cream. And I think they're covered in some form of really, really slippery silicon so they don't stick together and they slip around. And that way they're like not crushing each other mm -hmm. because with a little bit of pressure, they will, they will break. Okay. So you can see like I'm trying to squish them, but they're, they're slippery little suckers. They are indeed. They're really slippery. <laughs> Probably specially designed by people at Area 51 to smush them. Oh, it is. I can feel it. Ooh. It's fun. This is the most expensive Play-Doh ever. It is. It really, really is. Oh. oh, I wonder if I can get them to mush through the net. No. Oh. <laughs> this is so <laughs> gross. So I'm just going to see what the actual colour would look like. Chalky. Yeah, I think like all meteorites products, it's meant to be slightly brightening. So it's got like the peach shade, the green shade for redness and the pink shade. And that's sort of like the generalized um, color story that you use the most in color correcting with makeup. Um, but it is like... It's a fancy primer. Yeah, when it's like a one size fits all kind of thing, it doesn't work for everyone, obviously. But that's basically the premise behind meteorites. Brighton. So I think it's kind of fun. I mean, you saw what happens when you press the little sponge onto the netting and the product starts to come through. It looks like pressed meteorites. The formula feels nice. It's not, you know, overly greasy. Um, there's silicones in it and stuff like that. It's just meant to prime and brighten, prep your skin for makeup, but it's fun. And I gotta give props to Guerlain for doing something fun. They're the best balls I've ever seen on the Makeup Breakup. They're, yeah, they're, they didn't disappoint. Hands down, the best balls. Guerlain has a big set. <laughs> or a little set <laughs> with lots of them. I don't know, moving right along. We hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the Makeup Breakup. Tell us about the best makeup balls you've ever seen. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>